Hey everyone, welcome back to Swordbox. Today's verse is found in Matthew eleven twenty eight. 28. Then Jesus said, Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Um, you know, I was thinking about just as I was sweeping out a room um, and the broom, that today there are so many unsaved people who are trying to use our own brooms inside ourselves on our own lives. We think that if we clean our lives up, that that somehow we'll get to heaven. Or um, there's also people that that tell me a lot of times that they'll accept Christ as soon as they stop doing certain things in their lives. They think that they have to be um, very good people before they can be saved. You know, when Jesus was here on earth, he had told a story in Matthew 12, um, 43 through 45. It says, "When an evil spirit leaves a person, it goes into the desert seeking rest, but finding none." Then it says, I will return to the person I came from. So it returns and finds its former home empty, swept, and in order. Then the evil spirit finds seven other spirits more evil than itself, and they all enter the person and live there. And so that person is worse off than before. That will be the experience of this evil generation. You see, this man in the story got rid of all of his evil habits, even swept his house out. But what happened? The old habits returned and even more wicked ones came with them. And the last state of that man was worse than the first. You see, he tried on his own efforts to get rid of the sin and he failed. You know, if you're dealing with stuff today and you're burdened with a load of sin, quit trying to clean yourself and let Jesus Christ save you from the sin. When he does the work, he creates somebody totally new, a new creature. 2 Corinthians 5.17 says, The new has come, the old has gone. Christ came to save sinners. You know, if you realize today, and you put all of yourself on Him, because He does say, Come to Him, all who labor in heaven and laden. And He'll give us rest. You can't do it on your own, guys. You have to put it all on Christ. You have to give Him everything. You can't clean your own life up. It's impossible. Even if you give up a habit, it's going to return. It's going to keep coming back because you can't do it on your own. You have to do it with Christ. You guys have a great day as we go throughout the day, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.